Arr! Welcome to the Tech Spot, where we talk about the latest in gaming and technology news. I'm Joshua Caron, and this week we talk about robots, operating systems, and much, much more. Arr! <laughs> Microsoft recently announced that they'd be offering free upgrades to Windows 10, including to users who pirated the software. Which explains why I'm talking in this ridiculous accent. Arr! <laughs> Oh, oh, yeah, much better. This is great news for Windows users, but if you're planning on upgrading from a pirated version of the OS, you may not be able to upgrade other devices as they will still be considered non-genuine. But this shouldn't be a problem, seeing as no one really pirates software anymore. Windows also announced a new feature that will appear on the new operating system, Windows Hello. This feature will allow users to access computers and devices running Windows 10 via face recognition, iris identification, or fingerprint matching. Ah, right, mate, you call that a story? This is a story. Scientists discovered a fossil of a big land-dwelling crocodile this week that lived about 231 million years ago. Appropriately named the Carolina Butcher, this croc is said to have been roughly 3 meters long and 1.5 meters tall. Despite how scary this creature may have been, I'm sure it would have stood no chance against the legendary Steve Irwin. It's always dangerous working around big reptilian predators like these. Speaking of scary, From Software is in the spotlight this week with the release of their newest title, Bloodborne. Let's take a look. Bloodborne takes place in the gothic ruined city of Yarnum, which is rumored to house the remedy for any ailment. You play as a traveler in search of the remedy, but when you arrive to the city, you soon discover that it is plagued with an endemic illness that has most of the city's inhabitants transformed into bestial creatures. Bloodborne is exclusive to the PS4 and is in stores now. In an interview, Tesla CEO Elon Musk claimed that he believed driving a car will become illegal within our lifetime. Autonomous vehicles are supposed to be exponentially safer. However, regardless of how much safer these vehicles may be, some motorists are just too in love with their cars to give up the wheel. Have you heard of Indiegogo? Well, it's a lot like Kickstarter, except more indie and a lot more go-go. Sorry, Amber, I couldn't resist. What you're about to witness is a video from Indiegogo depicting your average family with one small addition. This guy. Introducing Chibo, the world's first family robot. Say hi, Chibo. Hi, Chibo. <laughs> the video claims that Jibo is a platform that will have many applications. It will be able to send you reminders, teach your children, and even act as a wingman. You have a voice message from Ashley. Want to hear it? Absolutely. Hey, call me when you're home. Better make that takeoff for two, Jibo. Well, that's all for now. Join us next time for more of the latest and greatest. I'm Joshua Karen, Algonquin now. <laughs>